I'd like to talk about Kazuya's character and the way I portray him. Now, there are a lot of people I am sure who hate the way I go about his character, but you gotta think what I'm trying to go for here. And hopefully you understand. Kazuya is not just some character who goes around and says, Die! 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 Destroy! 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 All the time! He is not just a flat-out evil prick, at least to me. In the original Tekken story, Kazuya sure was evil because of the devil gene, but also has his lighter moments until that red eye of his starts glowing. Kazuya has heart, and that's where a lot of people look past. They always seem to just look over the fact that Kazuya has a heart, and he also has a lighter side. Kazuya having a lighter side is what made him fall in love with June. If you watch the Tekken game recap from Tekken 6's scenario campaign, that is why I make it to where Kazuya and June are married. Tekken never explained their relationship in depth, and probably not until Tekken 8, so I took it upon myself to use that in my portrayal. Kazuya in the original timeline of Tekken is a badass, you know, making a deal with the devil to gain power while sacrificing his soul. Listen, just because he gets the devil gene doesn't mean he always wants to kill something and doesn't have a heart, because he does. I make Kazuya hate Jin, of course I make him hate Heihachi, because that ties into his character. And Kazuya loving June also ties into his character, because that's how it was supposed to be in the original story. But again, they never went in depth with it. I am. I'm taking that aspect of their relationship and putting it into my portrayal of Kazuya. And like Harada has stated multiple times, June is not dead. But we don't know if he's alive either. Like, they never go in depth with these things. So, for those people who think that June is dead, confirmed that's not true. She is MIA, missing in action. And I feel she is going to play a very important role in Tekken 8. I mean, what can I say? I love the character of June Kazama. Now back to my portrayal of Kazuya's character. Another problem people seem to have with my portrayal is that he jokes around. Now once again, Kazuya is not just an evil asshole. He also has a light side, as seen with the original story. But Tekken 7 is just all, You killed my mom! You killed my mom! Die! 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 I want Kazuya to be able to show his human side as well as his evil side, when necessary. The reason my Kazuya doesn't always show his demonic side all the time is because that's not how his original story was. Kazuya has a light and dark side, just like Jin Kazama, and that shines in my portrayal of Kazuya on the channel. I really hope you guys understand me on this, because I prefer the original Tekken story of Kazuya's character and not the stupid Tekken 7 retcon, you know, putting Kazumi in there and ruin the whole original story up. Like, it, it just, Kazuya, Kazuya is not just an evil, generic villain who wants to take over the world, like, he also has a light side to him, and that's what a lot of people, again, like to look over and look past. Like, Kazuya is, he's an anti-hero, in my opinion. He has his somber moments. He has his, you know, evil moments. He has his light and dark moments. And that's how I portray Kazuya. And that's why I love the character so much. If you manage to sit through the whole video without, you know, skipping ahead and stuff like that and actually listening to my reasoning on why I portray Kazuya the way I do, that's great on you. You get a cookie. <laughs> Thank you for listening. Do ya! If you have questions for me, leave them in the comments and I'll answer them.